Oh shit, I never hit the live stream button, so now it's preparing the live stream. So, oh shit, that was it worked kind of quick as a yeah. motherfucker on my Mac out this day. Yeah, this, this boom. Okay, now it's redirecting. Now it's going to the YouTube shit. And now we live out there. How long we how long we gonna be how long we gonna be on here? Oh uh, man, like you know what I'm saying, 35, 45 minutes. You know what I'm saying? I want to hold up your whole day, man. You no, know, no, saying? you're fine. I know you got shit you gotta do. What's going on, bitch up in this bitch, Frank up in this What's bitch? What's going on? On the YouTube, on the YouTube joint, you know, then you'll be able to see like the chat and everything on the side. I don't know if you're on the channel, you can see the chat on the side of it. You don't know, Mikey. Mikey in this bitch. Hey, yo, it's what they get. It's what they kind of like chiming. They about to about rolling in. All right, so um, I got. I, actually, it's kind of crazy. I was waiting for uh this thing to start so I can try out the um try out the uh, little sour sticks here. Yeah, they're gonna take a minute to kick. They wait, you know, a while to, to let it kick in. So, I gotta cut these open. Yeah, I ain't had these in a minute. I ain't had these in a minute. Oh shit, I gotta cut it open. Cut it. <laughs> you used to be chewing on the motherfucker, then I gotta cut it open. Now you know what I'm saying? You was a kid, you used to snap these joints off. That's right. Hang on, so. <laughs> Damn, I feel like trying to get the, I'm trying to get the chat to pop up, mate. Right? Let's see. Hmm. Ever since I had my wisdom teeth pulled, it kind of feel a little bit different now. Feel like, oh my God, the wisdom teeth. I'm pulling on this, man, and it made me feel like I'm about to throw up or something. I don't know. The scissors, bro. Come on, man. Man, I'm a man, God damn it. I don't got to go get on goddamn scissors. Well, actually, you know how that shit... <coughs> you know how it kind of gets gumped up at the top a lot of times? So you got to, like, you know... <coughs> you got to... I just, well... You know, back in the day, yeah, you was able to pop it right here at the top. Oh, well, yeah, 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 I got you. Man, I dumped that whole thing in my mouth, fell asleep on my couch. Make sure you don't fall asleep right here during the stream. Mm -mm. I've never had one of these. I'm going to have a customer come in. I might have mm -hmm. to mute it for a minute. I've never had a CBD stick. A Those are great. I need some. I kind of want some shit off. I still want some shit off. Kind of want to try these out. Um, food. Got a suggestion. I would post this on IG Live. I don't know how to do that shit just yet. I haven't fucked with the IG Live just yet. Because yeah, I know somebody like, was asking me about that too. Because I got it through my um, this is like going through my Zoom. I don't know how they do that. Shit. I don't know how they how they do that there. I don't know how they do that shit. We gotta talk to the Russians, bro. Uh, mm. God damn it. I don't know. P people like probably download it. Uh -uh. I don't like mm. You like that apple? <laughs> we like apple. We like sour apple. I ain't, had to, I ain't had one of these in a long goddamn time. And it's surprising with three fucking kids, I haven't had no goddamn pixie sticks. Yeah, so I mean, we got you know the all the flavors, you know, in a bundle. We got a skew for that on the mm. parts.com. or you can mm. buy them separately by flavor. You know? I forgot. Yeah. Woo. Um. <coughs> <coughs> kind of a hair brush out this bitch. You know what I'm saying? All right, so. We're gonna let um I'm gonna let D, you know what I'm saying, talk about, you know what I'm saying, the shop and everything. So we let everybody know yeah. like what's going on over there for show. Yeah, so basically, you know, we have a vape shop, best damn vapor over here in Boulder City, Nevada. We're kinda moving the locations right now and uh, opening up a hemp store. We're getting into, you know, kinda we're gonna have hemp stores in the country, you know. Um we're getting ready to launch a couple of them. Um, just getting more into the hemp oils, the hemp products, um, the botanical health and beauty type stuff, kind of this different kind of clientele, um, with a little bit of vape in it. But we're, we're building a big company so we can put stores all over the place. We also have the, the online right now, you know, which is the BigRipperParts.com. And Big Ripper Parts is our own brand of CBD cartridge, which are going to be releasing soon. But in the meantime, you know, we got some products from the colleagues that we wholesale and retail through this website. We got some free shipping on there. A lot of THC-free products like those sticks that you're 
that you're eating the magic six or THC free. Um, we ship, ship everywhere, just getting going. We're going to have a lot of our own, our own and popping up here soon. Got those jewel compatible pods and everything. You know, are you gonna have the jewel compatible pods too? We already got we already got them online. Can of pods. We got the milligram pack, and then there's a 500 milligram pack. So the 500 milligram only comes in the natural flavor, but we got the other flavors um, that come in the, only the 200. But... Yeah, Mike. He said he's in Nevada. He said he's in Nevada. He said he's in Las Vegas, Henderson. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. We can make you an account, Mikey. You can uh, order today and pick up in store over here in the city, or we can ship to your house. You know, usually ship uh, orders the same day, so it takes about a day to get to you. Yeah, go ahead and cruise over. I'll send the uh, create account link. So yeah. CBD stick. Uh, How you thought it was? I don't know who it was. Your ass falls out. I'm gonna make sure that was it. <laughs> hey, fuck y'all, yeah, man. That shit ain't. <laughs> like, I'm over here trying LC, L, L, uh, LCD sticks. What, what the fuck is that? The fuck? LCD. CBD. <laughs> hey, like, I'm over here also. So, um, See, that, that's the thing about it, too, you know. The, the, the hemp industry, you know, is, there's a lot of legal hemp growing, going uh, around right now in the isolate world, you know. There's Ooh. a lot of. A lot of stuff popping right now. Hey, hold on real quick. Hey, Mitch, could you get me the link for Big Ripper cartridges and um put that in the link in the, in the chat over here for me? Okay, so what happened was, right, uh, my L button went out on my keyboard. Oh, nice. <laughs> my L button went out on the keyboard, right? I was supposed to have ordered the little Bluetooth keyboard, and I was like, damn, man, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm fucking MacBook, you know what I'm saying? Keyboard, you know, shit went out, you know what I'm saying? Now I gotta get a whole new MacBook. And they was like, nah, just go ahead and get the, the the Bluetooth keyboard. You know, and I was like, oh shit, I forgot about it. And then I forgot to order it. So, you know what I'm saying? And right. I, I now I just basically have a fucking, uh, 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 no L key. So when I went to go type in, you know, like live with Big Ripper cartridges, I can't type in live with Big Ripper cartridges because I don't have no fucking L. Unless somebody sends me an L, you know. Uh, I got a, one of my boys here buying some vape products. Speaking of vape products, we're going to have those Jam Monster CBD. Um, it's going to be 500 milligram infused. We already have it. It's going to be on the website probably by the end of the weekend here. So hey, we got, yo. The, got the Jam Monster CBD Primal CBD. Jam Monster CBD A. Yeah. Jam and y'all know, y'all know, you know, you know. I'm gonna talk about that shit, y'all. I, I I I didn't know that they was doing that shit. He said they got the jam with the butter and the toast out the bitch and the fucking CBD. Yeah. Well, we we got the um, we got the jam monster, yeah, strawberry. That's our CBD infused flavor. This is all you know out of our colleagues' um, CBD infusion lab, of course, over there in uh, Seattle. They kind of mix between Boise, Idaho, and Seattle area. What you need, bro? I got a customer. Excuse me. Yeah, man. Make sure you <laughs> check them cards, cuz. Check them cards. I need to see IDs. <laughs> hey, that was Jay. That was Jay Hayes. Jay say, Jay say, man, soon. If that dude right there that's with the hat on, hey, man, look, you, you had to turn. Hey, look. It's a double me. It's a double me. That's cool as shit. Oh, shit. That's this is cool. Come over here. You're live online right now. Hey, you know what? I was a hey, man. Hey, what's up, you know? What up? Hey, what's up, bro? Man, what's up, man? It's those big way shit all day, man. Let them know big way all day. That's how we do it out here, babe. Get, get me set up. What kind of shit you getting out there today? You getting your CBD lungs correct? You getting the CBD? That's a little salt in it. Full of salt in it? Yeah, it looks like a little USB card, you know? I'm using the uh I'm using this um this Orion right here for my salt nicks and shit. We're gonna be getting those for sure. Love these little Orions, man. All right, so the um no for the CBD flower, hell no, um, uh, that's just that's what the that's what the um I thought that's what um D was saying right there. No, oh, no we, we well we do have C B D flower. Oh, you got flower. Yeah, we do have the flower. It's the um the caviar gold, we got the cabbie doobies and the cabby um like pre rolls. Um, they are on the website. Um, so, 
go to the website, hover over that shop button, um, and all the menus pop up. It's going to be on the CBD pre rolls. Oh yeah, I got pre rolled CBD. So like, I can go in there. I ain't got to even roll it. It's already come rolled out this bit. Yeah, yeah, because we got that that. Hold on now, is this saliva free? What? <laughs> is this saliva free? Or does this have a little bit of saliva on it? Because you know? I don't want no wet lip, motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Oh, my man. Get that drink out of the wrap, it look like this. <laughs> Uh-huh. All right, I'll see you, man. Oh, still all soggy and shit. You know what I'm saying? Looking like this when you got the rapper. You know, some people don't they do them wet noodle blunts and shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> nice. Look at you. <laughs> yeah, nah, man. My shit look my shit, my shit superb. You know what I'm saying? I got yeah, them I supreme, like I got them supreme rolls, man. I like I don't that. Roll hey, I don't roll lines like a lot of foolish. Other Check it out, man. Um, one of my boys works with um, the the Raw Factory. It seems like everybody knows someone that works at the Raw Factory, right? Same thing in Vegas over here. I know a guy that owns the biggest clinic in the world, right? No, whatever. But anyways, my boy works at the the Raw Factory. It's the Indonesian. Factory. But we can do like your custom pre roll cones with your brand on it. Uh huh. You know, we get oh, that's we, <laughs> yeah, like the your your is on the on the um, on the crutch and they come rolled up already you get a thousand in a box you know you get a thousand of them in a box we can give you as many as you want but we have a promotion so basically yeah so basically you stuff them you know what i'm saying and then you, know, you gotta stuff them but we just want to make sure the paper you know like these on, so the, the pre-roll so the other i don't know we're gonna find out though mike we will find out what's the name of the shop. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, so we can, do it. we can do it. It's a big box of a thousand, but they're same like that, you know. You would just uh, fill them. Yeah, so when you said the pre roll joints, you know what I'm saying? Like the CBD pre roll? Yeah. That's the that's the flower already rolled up, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're ready to go, the cabbies, cabbie newbies. Yeah, I'll send some to you. I got. I, I've never tried a, uh, a CBD flower. I haven't hey, tried. I'm gonna send it to you. Man, I'm sorry I didn't send those, but we're gonna send yeah. those. It's okay. Um, Mikey said, "What's the name of the shop out there?" Uh, Best Damn Vapor. Best Damn Vapor. Over here, you can just Google it. It's Best Damn, like D-A-M, Hoover Dam, because we're over here in the Hoover Dam town. So, uh, Best D-A-M. Vapor. Same thing on uh, Instagram. Best damn vapor Boulder City. You gotta put an underscore after every letter. Best underscore damn underscore vapor. Now but, I have the natural, I have the natural flavor. I um I thought that for a moment that this was like a flavored one. Um yeah, that's that's natural. People really like that that, that cartridge. Oh, I've already I, I most definitely tried it out. You most definitely get that earthy flavor. Mm-hmm. You know, definitely get that earthy flavor. Now, I'm not a big fan of the CBD vapes, you know, and it is totally different, of course, for those that do not know from like, you know, uh, well, I have the natural flavor, so I can't say what the flavor is like from, you know what I'm saying, um, my THC, car- well, for my THC cartridges, those are a little bit more different, of course, in flavor, like um, strawberry, banana, right. pineapple, OG. Um, infused. Yeah, so mine's a little bit different, of course, you know what I'm saying, from uh, the CBD one here. Um, what is a good voltage to press this one at? Um, I would say probably started low at like six, you know, five, something like oh, that. Nah, see, I got a variable voltage. This variable voltage right here, you know what I'm saying? Cause he's- oh, oh, it's the voltage. Um, I don't know, started low, you know. Uh, we had like uh, 3.7. I normally do 3.3. I mean, like for my, uh, for my ceramic, because these are ceramic coils up in here, I normally do like a 3. Point, uh, a three point uh, seven. Yeah, so most definitely, it, it, it's kind of crazy because sometimes it tastes a little bit like soap. It tastes a little bit like it has like a uh, like a soap type of taste. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of crazy. Um, but most definitely has an early taste, and it's kind of crazy the way that you know what I'm saying. It fires off the CBD fires off in this cartridge. Um, 
because in my other cartridge, you know, it kind of like, you know, well, I've had different ones that fire oh, off yeah. move. But actually, um, these cartridges, I can't think of the name of the box. Um, I think it's the D box. Um, my homeboys actually have the actual box that it comes that, um, you know, comes with this type of cartridge. And right. um, they said that they like the cartridge they sell. They said the cartridge is smooth. Yeah, see, I mean, they're mostly surround. All these cards, we deal with anybody needs any private label cartridges, those we could do the wood tip uh, C cells, the white and black tip C cells, half gram, full gram. These are nice, these flat top cardos. They're all full ceramic pretty much nowadays, wrapped with cotton. Um, all of them, like C cell, most of the ceramic is made out of one of the factories. Everybody kind of knows that, but we actually like. Um, my cartridges are going to be coming in a top airflow cartridge with an adjustable airflow. Um, the company that makes those makes most of the ceramic for the carts. So a lot of the, you know, a lot of people, you know, um, messing with the carts right now, cl claiming that C cell is the best. But if you ever had to ship a C cell, like if you fill them with CBD or with whatever you want, and then you ship them, when you get them, you know, they're always like, they always kind of leak a little bit. Um, people have trouble shipping them. Um, there's a lot of other parts that are leak proof uh, a little bit, a little bit, you know, I, yeah. I like those C cells. I like all of them. These flat tip carts though, you got to kind of thin it, get it to lay in your mouth. Right. And that's what kind of sucks. Cause there's no round tip. You got to spin it. Yo, like not my best cart. Well, one of my best carts is not a C cell. But it's smooth as hell. This is a clear one. THC. Shout out to my plug out here in these streets. Um, he turned me on to all these cartridges. And um, this is the one that he shot me the latest, which has a like a regular little wicking up in it, regular little clear mouth. Um, it's smooth as hell. You can even can't even really tell you're getting a good draw off of them. Which one is it? This is called a clear. This is uh oh, I got my cameras up there. Has a little, uh, just like a little clear miser. Mm -hmm. Um, this right here is ultimately smooth, like buttery smooth on the draw. Um, <clears throat> you can't even hear nothing kind of activating up on that one. <clears throat> nice and smooth as hell. And it's kind of crazy because when I take this out of the packaging, you know, um, it's like first automatic, you get a nice little, you get this like weed smell, you get like a weed smell to it. But of course, uh, well, you know what I'm saying. You vape it, you don't get that. You know, you ain't gonna get that. That smell. You know, I like the um, most of the products that we have on Big Brother Hearts. There's, you know, an unflavored or a natural flavor um, version of most of the consumables. And um, yeah, you know, I, I love people like the flavor. Now you do have yeah. you do have some flavor ones, of course. Yeah, yeah. See, I have my Big Ripper cartridges that are gonna be coming sold out on the uh, website but those are going to be like derp infused um they're on the way actually we got 200 of them that are going to be for sale here so it should be landing probably in the you know by by wednesday i would say probably um now oh uh, they said they've been, uh ali said that they've been the 500 milligram full spectrum cbd on the goon yeah yeah, what brand? What brand are you vaping, Ali? Are you you dripping? Obviously, you doing the um, some Koi CBD or man, a lot of people like this to to vape the CBD. It works really well, you know. I a lot of people love that Koi. Yeah, that Koi is good stuff, man. It's three thousand milligram. I don't know. A lot of people love that Koi. The, yeah, um, Koi is good. These um. These gummies ain't bad. Yeah, that, that natural gummy flavor is good. People really like that natural flavor instead of the sour. I was going to send you sour. I'm like, nah, this natural flavor is good. This was actually pretty good. Yeah, it was kind of, it was crazy. These were actually pretty good. I ain't really, um, it's not really like you get that, uh, you don't really get a lot of that earthy taste out of these right here. You most definitely get more of a um, candy gummy taste. I was kind of like scared thing, and I was going to be getting like some, um, a lot of like earthy taste of all yeah, these. No. Oh, yeah, not with those. So yeah, these, man, these, you know these these kind of candies are dangerous, man. Like you know, you know. Like, <laughs> um, 
you know, they, they, you can definitely, you know, feel the, 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 you kind of get the chill feeling, you know. I'm trying to think, man. Yeah. Um, nah, 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 nah. Um, What's up? That was some, I think that was something else. That was, that was some, oh, matter of fact, that's what I meant to ask you, though. Yeah, matter of fact, that's what it was right there. What the hell was that you was vaping on right there? Oh, well, this is the, the blue, bro. The my blue. This is a pod device. It's okay. I like the flavors. I don't like the, you know, it doesn't function the best. You know, there's a lot of Nah, I thought you had like a little CBD. I thought you had like a little TAC stick or something like that. Like a. Uh, oh, no, nah, no, nah, no. Nah, you know, I, I'm a, like, um, what's the fucking I'm, name of that? Brass Knuckles cartridge or some type of shit like that. Yeah, see, we, um, similar to brass knuckles you know I mean, that, that's you know you see brass knuckles for sale everywhere and it's like how is that like how is that it's that's the, weird because people are claiming that they're not real i don't people are claiming that what um there's i was reading some threads online i think on insta or something and there's the haters there's like this massive divide you know among the the people that are using those um, brass knuckles you know um there's i so many, have I was just telling my homeboy Mitch about that shit. Um, I got a five. I actually have a, um, I have a brass knuckles cartridge, you know, but it wasn't authentic. Well, it wasn't like officially from brass knuckles, but they were like their cartridges. Um, well, that's the China thing, right? So I don't know, like, if these are the actual same type of threading that they're using on their cartridges. But you know what I'm saying? Like they like you say, they're like from the China, you know, like this is where they come from anyway, you know? Um, and the threading on them, like if I was to put that on my, if I was to put that on my mod, it would kind of like lean to the side or some type of shit like that, you know? So um, I, it wasn't kind of like one of the best five tens on the threading, but I mean, like I did get a good vape off of the cartridge itself. It did have a nice, you know, like chimney on the cartridge and everything. But as far as like the five ten. The five ten threading on them is fucked up, and um, but I so I'll talk. But this is some, it's a lot of like different kind of like you know what I'm saying cartridges most definitely out there. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, I ain't know they had jam monster CBD though. That's very new to me, babe. Oh yeah, no. So we're gonna have um by the end of the by the end of the week, um we're going to um I put my link in there again. <laughs> Um, we're gonna have so let me let me. Oh, um, I can't put I can't um give you your link because I got to give you a, a rent so you can put the link in there. Can I let me let me can I show pictures? Oh, the, can I send you some. Oh, let me see. Um, I bet so now you can throw a link now you can throw your link in there. Okay, let me see. Oh yeah, I was just gonna <coughs> be clear that we do the CBD. But yeah, we're gonna be having um, the known distro flavors, you know, that primal run. Um, it's a lemonade flavor. Oh, what is it? Let me take a look real quick. You can go um, over to. Um, let me see. Here. I'll tell you the ones that we're gonna have. They're all primal. Run. I still. We're going to be having the Jam Monster Strawberry, the Nominons liquids, which are lemon, the lemon, and also the Stranominon. There's two of them. Those are in 350 milligram, 60 mils. Now, these are CBD, people. These are CBD. Motherfucking, you know what I'm saying, joints right here. He said, I need the TAC pods for my Ceron is. <laughs> yeah. I think they, do they have the TAC pods for the Cerons? I mean, you can, you can make whatever they really want. I'm pretty sure, you know what I'm saying, you can probably, you know what I'm saying, um, you know, like, take one of them syringes and shoot that shit up in there, you know what I'm saying, but you yeah. have to have a clean pod for it. Yeah, I mean, you got to make sure the viscosity is right or else it's going to burn wrong, you because know? That's, because they got the stizzy. The stizzy pods are like the, um, the stizzy pods are like that. Have you seen the stizzy ones? Yeah, stizzy's nice. You better not go and pull out a stizzy. Pull out a stizzy. He's loaded up over there. And he's, 
Yeah. yeah. He's loaded up, man. Hey, and so um, he said, uh, we need to island bait CBD. Maybe on the islands. Yeah, my people over there on the islands, man. You know what I'm saying? We be having big things popping off, man. One motherfucker got stabbed on the boat. You know what I'm saying? Stabbed on the boat. Yeah, man, big things be popping off, man. Big things be popping off. One of my homies, you know what I'm saying, was in the little chop shop building a, a, a hole in a ditch, you know what I'm saying, out back and shit on the big hole, you know what I'm saying? Not on a big hole, but you know what I'm saying, the big hole, you, you, you know, the big back hole, you know what I'm saying, that, that big right. I ain't talking he was riding on the back of a big bitch, you know what I'm saying? And she was digging holes and shit while he was on her back, you know, like a rhinoceros. But, you know, like with the, you know, the folks talking about and shit. Fizzy and darts are nice, you know what I'm saying? Homeboy Mike in LA, he know what that shit's about. You know, he know what's going on, you know what I'm saying? That's Mike in LA. You know, out there in LA. Mike's in LA. Hey, um, my 500 milligram CBD oil used in my goon. He used it in his goon? I got two 30 mils for only 50 bucks. 500 milligram CBD. What size bottle? 230 mil for 50. Yeah, I mean, uh, I mean that's about like what the price of the Tamron is probably gonna be. You know, that's 500 milligram. I mean, 500 milligram. You know, I guess with the CBD market, you know, you should be paying the same uh, price uh, based on milligram across the board. But for the topical creams, 500 of each should be around the same price if it's 500. It would take a few dollars. Um, paying for the CBD content. Now, man, when I first got, I like a couple of years ago, when I first saw the CBD, like, you know, e juice kind of like come out and everything, man, that shit was like, uh, man, it was like $80, $90 for 15 mil bottles. 15 mil bottles. They, they was hitting the head for the dollars. I, I have know. some discounts. I don't know why your audio goes in and out. It's like I you. Turned, and, I turned you down. Um, I don't know. So. If it's like you know, what I'm saying you in the. Uh, it's like you on the cell phone and you keep hitting bad reception and shit. Man, what do I do about that, man? <laughs> what do I do about that, guys? What am I doing, bro? Hey, I don't know what you doing. That's what I was trying to figure out. What the hell was you doing? It was like, you know what I'm saying? You was getting some messages and shit, and the shit would just cut off for a second, then it like kind of pop back in out this bit. So, so select a microphone. Um, nah, you don't got to select the microphone. Don't fuck with the microphone settings. Don't fuck with the microphone settings. You might cut your whole shit off, man. See, see, I, see I told him. Told him. You know what I'm telling him? Fuck with the microphone settings? I, I got it. I'm, I'm back. Oh, okay. <laughs> we got to get that nipped in the bud, though. Yeah, pause for a second. I mean, like, I don't know. I don't know what kind of microphone you're working off of. You're probably working off of the PC. It's the built-in. It's the built-in joint. We got to get one external, you think? Um, My shit ain't external. My shit's internal. I don't even use my, uh, I ain't even, I ain't use my headset in a minute lately. I don't like I don't like having that shit on my head. I like having freedom. So when I want to get up, I don't have to take them motherfuckers off and get attached to my shit and, and take the whole fucking PC with me. You know what I'm saying? As I'm leaving out this bitch. Let me test my microphone. It says, uh, see, it says it's working, man. You know? See? Oh, I can hear it. But it was like in the beginning, it was kind of like just cutting in and out. Um... All right, back to this Jam Monster shit, though, man. Like, when the Jam Monster start doing this out this bitch? Huh? I ain't even got my Jam Monster. I got the, my Jam... Well, well, well oh, look, let, let, look, let... Huh? I got the hats. I got, already got the hat. I don't need no more hats. Unless it's ACBD on in that, you know what I'm saying? I, like, I got you. So, let's, let's, let's... Um, So, we'll do... Um, Let me send you the Jam Monster. And then, um, let's see what else. I'll send you that primal learn. That's good stuff right there. That's um, orange strawberry lemonade. I never heard of that one. Yeah, that's made by Known Distro. That's a good one. They also have the primal. How um, they known? I don't know them like that though. They got good juice. <laughs> You're about to know them. <laughs> Hey, so like, y'all gotta like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you on the strip, right? 
close to it. So like, hold on, it's a five. Somebody just got shot and shit. Does hey, um, man. Detroit Vapor, I'm trying, bro. Uncheck the button to adjust automatic. What is that? Hang on, bro. Hang on, man. <laughs> I don't know what he's doing, Turk. I mean, like, you know what I'm saying? Hey, my audio good, though. Oh, shit. I ain't even, I know my audio fuck. I'm shit. I'm just a little bit all the way out there. Horrible. <laughs> I just woke up not too long ago, and I'm going to be back asleep real quick. I'm, I'm just doing too much on this bitch. I've been waiting to try, man. You know, I've been waiting all week to try these fucking gummies and shit. I ain't want to try really shit. You know what I'm saying? Only thing I tried was a cartridge. I tried the cartridge, you know. Um, cartridge is good. And I had to talk to my constituents about got this. got a customer. Stuff. Hang on one sec. Go ahead. I had to talk to my constituents about these cartridges because a lot of people know that I don't really do a whole lot of CB things, you know, because I'm always already high as shit. You know what I'm saying? And there's a lot of other people out here that's more of a beneficial situation, you know, um, Got people out here with missing thumbs and shit, you know what I'm saying? Got back problems out this bitch, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to name names like a son of a bitch, you know? But, you know, we got a lot of people out here, you know what I'm saying, that got issues and shit. I got one of the homeboys that was out here on the backhoe. We don't want to name names about him. But he, um, you know what I'm saying, fucked up his leg and shit. So now he out here. I might have to send him, like, two of these gummies and shit. You know what I'm saying? Let him see what's going on. But the gummies are pretty legit. Um, The gummies I had, the hemp bomb joints. And they are a little bit, they, these were better to me in tasting than the hemp bomb ones. The hemp bomb ones taste a little bit more of the, um, they had a little bit more of the CBD type taste to them, you know, so. Hemp taste, yeah. Yeah. Now, these ones only the 200. These are the 200. These are the 200. Dude, I, my buddy makes these, he makes these five milligram lozenges and you just eat them all day. And by the time you get home, it's kind of, Kind of fluttering a little bit, you know. I got, you know, most people like <laughs> they definitely got a, you know, people. I get a lot of older customers, man. They need it for the pain. They got MS. They got all kinds of ailments. You know, usually trying to get off of opiates, and they come in. They know what they want. They want the thousand milligram. They want the topical cream. They know what they want. You know, so usually the people that are taking it or using it have pain. Ooh. Now, okay. now because of your location. Can you smoke weed in your shop? <laughs> you know, so in this town right here, bro, in Boulder City, unfortunately, we're not allowed to have any THC dispensaries here. Um, it's a small town. Um, they're really, they we're not allowed to have casinos, strip clubs, weed clinics, anything like that in this little town. But right around the corner in Henderson, Nevada, 10 minutes away, you can buy your herb. Ain't that where um that's where uh that's where um hold up that's where Mikey at right? Mikey out there. <laughs> that's where Mikey at. Mikey right around the corner from you. Yeah. So yeah, Mikey basically is walking up in the shops. You know what I'm saying? Smoking his weed and getting his rocks. You know what I'm saying? What's going on, Train? Just had to do that. I had I had to bring. You know what I'm saying? Dion, so he can talk about, you know what I'm saying, the shop and the website, because the website is up now, so people can go over here and check out the CBD product and the CBD yeah. cartridges, you know, because a lot of my people do the vape thing, you know. We're so. going to be having our big ripper cartridges, man. We're going to, the, the cartridge that's on the main page, we got a little bit delayed on it, uh, but we're going to have those. We're going to have the, the uh, I think, four flavors, Turp Infused Skittles, um, Girl Scout Infused Cookie. Skittles? What's that? What, what, Skittles? Zittles? Yeah. Skittles strain, yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be good. We're gonna be doing a lot of those. You know, See, like you that. know, it sucks because I want to put devices on the website. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, man. <laughs> I want to put devices on the website, but I gotta put that nicotine warning on there if I do that, right? Even if I have a device, the new regulations. Yeah. You gotta have it on the website. If I put one device on there for y'all to buy, like a bundle. Yeah. Yes. Even on the like, this is the this is the Orion. Yeah, everything. This is the Orion. Everything. So, I mean, like, oh, here it is, right here. This is the. I just got it in this packaging, but this is like the big 
Um, this is like the brass knuckles cartridge right here. Let me see. Hang on one sec. Creating everybody a discount code for the website right now. Do, do, do. And use that. I'll put coupon <laughs> code real quick. What's um, up? <laughs> Somebody just ordered uh, some pods, but um, make sure we give them a special deal uh, next time they order, because I'm just putting this coupon code in right now. Let's do coupon code FOOLISH. Oh, you a foolish, vape way, you know what I'm saying? I think all our, a lot of our codes about to be vape way out this bitch. Ooh, look, I like this shirt. Vape you know? way out this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> so tell, me more about your, tell me more about your, about your store, FOOLISH. What's the deal? The the what? Like you 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 got a store out there? A store? Hell no, nah, we don't got no store. We we online. We we have the virtual shop. You know what I'm saying? My shop is virtual, so people just go online, do their purchases and everything. I'm kind of like in the mix of a lot of things, so you know what I'm saying. The virtual shop definitely just helps things out. I don't even have to do anything. I don't get anything up off of the deal. I just go ahead and well, I do get up. I do get. I do get a lot of the deal. Um, it's not a money beneficial situation. But it is a um, no, it's like getting to know a lot of people, you know what I'm saying, and getting to meet up with a lot of good people. Um, and that's how I've actually been able to get a lot of the knowledge and shit that I have, you know. Um, right. All just do, you know what I'm saying, connections. You know what I'm saying? It's um, pretty, you got to, you know, it's like you, people fuck with you because they fuck with you, you know what I'm saying? Like an arrogant motherfucker will fuck with an arrogant motherfucker because they like arrogant shit, you know what I'm saying? So, you fuck me. Hey, age day, you son of a bitch. You know what I'm saying? See, that's what I'm talking about. Shit like that. You know what I'm saying? I heard you was at the motherfucking shop the other day, motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? He came up to the motherfucking barber shop and shit and didn't even want to let a motherfucker know he was up there and shit giving out some rock out this bitch. Fuck you, age. <laughs> fuck you. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my homeboy E Man J up there, though. I see you, cuz. You know what I'm saying? Hey, man. So, um, we, we, I never, I never wanted to do like no, uh, like the shop or anything like that. It's kind of crazy right. because everyone was always asking me about, you know what I'm saying, coming out with the, the um, well, I was kind of in a way working on the little juice thing, but I don't know, man. That kind of like got hung up or, you know, it kind of got hung up a lot of times. So um, I said, uh, we're going to, I'm, I'm going to revamp that situation and do that on a whole nother plateau. Um, so I still got that done on the mental. Um, then I also got the, um, we got the jewelry thing. Then we got the, uh, the groups and all this other kind of stuff. You know, I got to do the channel too, you know, so. Pretty much getting pulled in a lot of directions, you know, and it's motherfuckers like this over here and shit. It's, it's just, just, you know, I'm making things like Trinity Vibes. Hey, you know, so we, I had to ditch, I had to ditch that online shop thing. Couldn't have it. And even with the website, we was going to have the website. You know what I'm saying? That didn't kind of like, you know, I just. Hey, yeah. so, so, so you, you have the online store? No. Huh? No online store? No, I won't do the online store. Everything is in the group. You know what I'm saying? We on. I can't release a whole lot of information on the, on the. I plead the fifth. I plead the fifth. You know what I'm saying? We we'll talk. We we'll talk about it. <laughs> I can't do the online. I can't do the um. You know, you got the shop. You know what I'm saying? We I got the shop, but we don't do TAC products. You know, we don't do TAC. We don't do CBD. You know what I'm saying? We just do regular e juice in streets. You know, you come on over here and get you some of the treat factory uh strawberry joint has a crazy little exhale but you know it's a double dose on the strawberry oh well you know um <laughs> got, got some other shit too but um what else hey shout out to trinity babe shout out to my hand, uncle and raw shout out to my people over here in the building i see y'all over here in the chat but yeah that's, got a lot of, we, we mainly do a lot foolish of code on the checkout there foolish code save 15 percent full on the, on the order Use and that's that no minimum required you know what I'm saying? I don't no. know what. Got free see, shipping too. Shit. See this was, and my, my my crew know all about this shit. You know what I'm saying? They know that they don't sponsor us. We sponsor them. You know what I'm saying? We just sponsored this man live. Somebody go find Donnie bitch ass. Somebody go find that bitch ass motherfucker. And let him know what the fuck we doing over here. You know what I'm saying? I ain't seen a sponsor a motherfucker in the past six months. I don't know what the fuck you doing over there. I think he back to rocks and blunts, but he telling everybody don't do drugs. I don't know what he got going on over here. Cause I'm doing the drugs. Fast rocks me. Rocks and you know blunts. What? I love it out this bitch. <laughs> what do they call that? They call it the voo, right? The voo. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He on that flag shit. You know what I'm saying? He's straight webby out this bitch. You know what it is, man? Hey, cuz. Hey, where, where the fuck is Freddy? 
You know what I'm saying? Freddie need to come on over here and get him some CBD products, you know what I'm saying, with them burnt ass fingertips, you know what I'm saying? Get this shit right out of this bitch. We already know what it is, cuz, you know what I'm saying? Big things rolling out here, man. You know, we talking big things, championship reigns. Look at the motherfucking semi truck, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't have a semi truck. I was just lying about that. Everywhere we look, you see diamonds, bro. Diamonds, diamonds, diamonds. Hey, look, man. Shit, I, I see a diamond know. laying in the shit shining. That's what that's from you on that flag shit too. I see you with that webby shit, cuz you know what I'm saying? Hey man, look at me. Look that man, it's a whole lot. Hey, so everybody know what's going down. This is a uh, big ripper cartridges, you know what I'm saying? This is this man's shop. This is what he's doing out here. Um, I that's his shop. We're not in the same, it's not like I'm in the back room and here in the front of the motherfucker. This is yeah. that's told it he to the respect. Yeah, what's up? Yeah, it's big ripperkarts.com. Basically. We're getting ready to do the more more wholesale with the retail, but we do a lot of the white label stuff. If y'all need any cartridges um, with your logo on it, if y'all need any child safety packaging with your label on it, any type of cardo related batteries with your label on it, we can make all that stuff. Usually it's about a 500 minimum order. Um, so we've been selling a lot of custom vape batteries like spinners and stuff. Um, to a lot of smoke shops all over all over the country because they want they want you know custom batteries because cart sales the ego batteries I had some people at vape shops tell me like you got ego batteries what I'm like what the hell are you talking about you know I sell more e fucking ego batteries and spinners than I sell box mods. People want and my homeboy wanted me to get a spinner. My homeboy Brent wanted me to get a spinner. He over there on the islands and shit. He's like, yeah, bullies, you need to get that. I got that new, that new Vision Spinner 4.8 volt, man. Things are fucking monster, bro. But see, that's why I don't need the spinner because I have, you know what I'm saying, the Ely. Oh, uh, the spinner, the battery lasts forever, bro. Well, what's you know? the battery size on the spinner? Shit, like 1,400 mAh or something like that. The fuck, how big is that motherfucker? It, it's a big spinner, bro. It's a new version. They got these fat boys, dude. They're, they're I'm about to say that's the size of a fucking eighteen six fifty. It's bigger than a Sharpie marker. Yeah, it's the big round one, and they're nice. You got rubberized paint, white cream colors, and all kinds of stuff. I'm gonna send you one. I'm about to come out there and see you. Wait. Don't give me like that, cause you know what I'm saying. Motherfuckers talking, they're gonna pop up and pull up and shit. You know what I'm saying? They on that flat webby shit. A lot of people on eight. Hey. I was just in Jersey, bro. I just got back from Jersey two days ago, man. I, I wish you would have said something. I got people up there in Jersey. Lil Mike, you know what I'm saying? Big Tony and them, you know what I'm saying? All of them up there in Jersey, man. You should have said I was over there in Amboy, man. Once I could have got you a nice little Philly sub and all that kind of good little shit because we got big things. I'm talking about championship reign with the, just a cheesecake, man. Hey. I want, the, I want the, some sub with rocks in it. You know what I'm saying? You should have said something. I could have had that shit special with you. Cheese keeping them. You know what I'm saying? Like they come up, man. I I, I have them get the, the the full platters and all that kind of shit. Unk man, Roy, he's out there in California right now. You know what I'm saying? Chilling with my Crips and my Bloods and shit. You know what I'm saying? Bayway out this bitch. He out there in Cali right now, representing the Bayway. Got bitch. him on a sponsored trip in Cali out this bitch. You know what I'm saying? He had to head it, cut his hair, cutting his eyebrows to get it. But you know what I'm saying? It was a sponsored vacation. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people. Somebody will get Donnie out here and let him know that we cooking bacon. You know what I'm saying? Yo, hold on, man. This is the highest shit. You know what I'm saying? That's one of the most dumbest things about it. Um, I have a question. He said, so I got hemp oil. Oh, he can see the question. Um, hemp oil in the uh, spectrum, a thousand milligram, but it says uh, for baby. <laughs> oh, I got it right here. Hold on. <laughs> for vaping, but I've been using it in my tank. It should be able to use it in your tank. I don't see why not. For vaping, right? Yeah, he said it says it's for vaping, so you should be able to use it in your tank. Yeah, you can use it in a tank. A lot of some of the tinctures we got, like some some of the koi tinctures, is vapeable or sublingual. You can use it in the mouth or in the vape, but it does work better um, in the vape as far as the koi goes. Um, but yeah, if it says you could use it in the tank, then you can use it. Uh, so I know one of your main questions got to be. This got to be one of your main questions. Do you get high off of this? Well, yeah, can you get messed up? So basically, um, you know, you're not going to get like 
stoned off it, you'll if you eat enough of it, you should definitely feel an effect. I don't recommend like driving. We don't give medical advice, of course, but you know I don't recommend like um, it's not you know products aren't recommended for pregnant breastfeeding. Um, we don't recommend like if you you know if you take some of that caviar gold three thousand milligram tincture. If you're a cancer survivor, that's one thing because cancer survivors are on a heavy regimen of CBD. I mean heavy regimen like gallons of the shit, you know, but for an average user with no ailments, I um, mean, they, if they eat, you know, a good amount of it, I mean, it put me, it puts me on my couch. Like when I ate that 25 milligram, uh-huh. I was like on my couch for a little while, you know, like a cat nap type of shit, you know? So, I mean, I always tell people, you know, when they're figuring out how it's working in their body to give themselves a couple hours after they take it to see how it affects you know, are working with them because for everybody is different depending on what they got going on, you know. So, I mean, you definitely want to give it time to take effect, you know, which they say two to three hours. Now, hold on. Before <clears throat> before I go to that one, um, he said that it does, Ali said that it does not say it's for vaping. Right. I got you. Um, Auto correct. So, I mean, how's it been working? Because if it's an alcohol-based tincture, uh, or like if it's if it's, you know, it, it depends on like what it's made from. If it's alcohol or MCT or what it is, you know. But I mean, is it work? Is it is it working for you? <laughs> I mean, what's going on, Charles Johnson? Charles Johnson is another. I got uh, a customer. I'm gonna put you. I'm gonna mute it real quick. Go ahead. Got Charles Johnson in the building. He's another CBD advocate. You know what I'm saying? He's been sitting out here um, working on cars for the past 25 years. Motherfucker ain't got the tie put back on the car yet. You know how motherfuckers take a long time to get back to the goddamn job they're working on. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get it. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get it. Just leave it right there. Like my, I could put the fucking tie on because I'm gonna get it. God damn it. Yeah, you know, so Charles most definitely is another motherfucking CBD advocate that loves this goddamn shit. Charles, we had a coupon code, you know what I'm saying? I said, I didn't say the Tiva. I said sal- saliva. Saliva. I ain't say no goddamn sativa. Saliva. You know what I'm saying? We were talking about the pre roll, and I was asking him, was it saliva free? You know what I'm saying? Like Saliva free. You know, all that, the road, you know what I'm saying? The wet blunt type shit, you know what I'm saying? Got that live stream, um, Foolish Babes doing the review. Heavy hard, heavy harvest, uh, heady harvest, heavy harvest, heady harvest CBD products, sugar sticks, magic sticks. What's going on, got, Kevin? Got my boy over here visiting the shop. Cigar. Yeah, you might. Switch from cigars to vaping. So when you, before you went before you got into the CBD thing, you was like like um doing a lot of regular vaping. Yeah, I was doing wholesale retail. Uh, in a few warehouses, you know, on the west coast over here, you know, um, linked oh, up. Your audio, you know, <laughs> your audio <laughs> you know, linked up. You know, I don't know. Your audio had went out again. So <clears throat> you said you was already doing like regular vaping shit, you know what I'm saying? And then um you started to migrate over into the C B D shit. That's right. So you was getting a lot of people coming in, hey play Louisiana. So you was getting a lot of people, you know what I'm saying, kinda coming in Louisiana, requesting for the what's up, girl? Yeah. Oh, you know lady? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just follow her on Instagram. Yeah, she's cool. <laughs> yeah, That's what's yeah. up. Uh, what's so up, lady. Yeah, Wait, so I mean, you know, <laughs> I wanted I wanted to get more than just vape in the shop, so we started, you know, getting CBD in here, and the CBD, you know, it's good. I guess not, you know, it, the vape industry is a little bit different. Um, we're years into it. We're in the third turn of FDA regulation. This is they're hitting yeah. the they're chipping apart this industry, man. They want it. They want the cocaine, the heroin, the alcohol, and the nicotine. And I'm trying to tell people like that are going over. You know, I saw in Vape Magazine, Vape Wholesale Magazine. Um, can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah, I saw in Vape Wholesale Magazine talking about monetizing your vape shop with the CBD. 
you know, everybody having a CBD section of their store because it's getting more mainstream now. But if we bring CBD into the vape shops, don't you think the government keep trying to continue to throw CBD into the same realm? I think we should kind of keep this up because we have to learn from the vape industry and in any industry we go to, if we treat it the same or similar, shut us down there too. You know, they're going to try to, uh, you know, the government's way, you know, it attacks every industry, the scuba diving industry, you know, um, the vape industry, um, the government attacks every industry. I'm just saying we, in the e-cigarette industry, I wish we would have strategized more for the problems that we have currently to be able to. And you know what? I mean, like, you know, when it was coming about, I don't think a lot of people was thinking that it was going to, you know what I'm saying, start taking the um, the hits that it was taking, you know, and as after we crowned, after we, after we had crossed one mountain, you know what I'm saying? We never thought that it was going to be other, you know what I'm saying, obstacles to face, you know what I'm saying? We didn't think it was going to, especially like at the, at the point is that now when they're talking about either banning online sales or flavors, you know what I'm saying? I don't think no one really expected that shit, you know, like, this is the option that you're fucking giving it, you know what I'm saying? Like, well, that's fucking kind of crazy as shit. And it's these fucking kids with these fucking jewel pods, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. These fucking pods, man, you know what I'm That blue shit ain't no fucking bad. That blue, I don't, I, I, you probably paid a dollar for that motherfucker too, didn't you? Oh, dude, you I, this is, dude, this is, this is one of the apes I got. You got the dollar for You know, I got, we carry all kinds of apes on us, you know? This is just the one that's got battery right now, bro. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> when they got the back. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but, man, uh, that blue, the blue was like a dollar. Yeah, it's not expensive. I got the intense flavor. Yeah, I mean, I wasn't a fan. I'm not a fan of those as much as I am as, you know what I'm saying, my own refillables, you know. So um, when I first saw, you know, when I first kind of got into, like, the pods, you know, like, those were, like, um, I didn't have refillables. That, well, no, I did have the MyJet. There was one called the MyJet. And oh, that yeah, was kinda, the uh, Yeah, and that was kind of well, cool. You see, but now it's a lot better. It's interesting because when the E Leaf Eye Care came out like two years ago, nobody knew what the hell it was for. And then, like, the Wismic My Jet came out and it kind of flopped because nobody knew what it was for. And then, like, all of a sudden, the Salt Nick came out and then it kind of went back, right? And brought everything back, right? Right. So when the Eye Care came out, people were like, what the hell? And I would, and it was crazy because I forgot that the MyJack was the refillable pod system. And it was like, like you said, that joint came in and went right out the door because a lot of people didn't know the usage. Well, it wasn't like, you know what I'm saying, salt nicks were really relevant as they are now. So that was kind of, you know what I'm saying, a little bit crazy. I forgot about that shit. Hey, Trini. Yeah, oh, I see French, French Coast. Yeah, you know, in business, like, I think a lot of the energy and time and money go have you into having to plan for the un, uh, un, unaccounted things like you know there's a lot of vape shop owners as soon as they open five shops somebody tries to sue them and you know as soon as you get big you know someone tries to sit you know someone tries to say you have a battery complaint or something you know we have insurance for that but like other stuff in the industry that's happened the jeweling thing and stuff um i don't sell to miners um in my town there's a big problem with in um i don't serve them and i lose a lot of money because i don't i lose a lot of money because i I refuse because i have a nail salon next door i have um people that work with the city coming in here and it's against the law but and i don't condone any underage use or overage use of any kind of chemical alcohol weed i don't condone nothing but um i don't serve to the kids um, because they go talking. I, don't, I lose oh, the money, get, but you get your shit shut down quick. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, there, there's no point. Like, when they sell a five dollar coil and get shut down, like, uh-huh. there's no way. And when they come in, if I got somebody that's 18 and they come in with people under age, I'm, I'm, you know, that's a, that's a uh-huh. thing too, you know, because it's the like legal, the legal age to purchase is 18 out there. Yeah, but they try to come in with under. I, it's my job to make sure that they're not buying for them. And if somebody comes in and they're 18 and other people that aren't trying to come in, kick them out. And I have the person that's 18 sign right. a paper 
that says, you know the rules if you buy this product and the rules are it's for you. You're going to be held responsible if we find out you gave it to those people. Like They're signing that paper. That's what's up. Because they came with people that were. They made themselves obvious. Well, it's not that they were selling, getting it for them. It's just that I don't know. And I'm making like them. Said, like I said, they're making themselves obvious because you coming up. The, the, a lot of motherfuckers ain't, you know what I'm saying, smart as the next motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Well, the, the, one person ain't going to say, stay outside. The other person like, yeah, come on in. Come on in and look and see what you want. And just let me know. A lot of motherfuckers ain't mindful. You know what I'm saying? So, of course, you're making yourself the fuck obvious. You know what I'm saying? You're coming up in there and you tell your, well, you know, your friends got to go. We used to, we used to stand on the side of the goddamn store and wait for someone to buy us cigarettes when we were twelve. And you know that's the whole thing with the flavor ban, Schumer, and that Jack Waxman kid spearheading the movement, uh, the the flavor ban national bill. There's Chuck Schumer spearheading it, and and um, you know basically, um, when it comes to the flavor ban, is what I don't understand is I started smoking cigarettes at twelve. They tasted like shit, and I still smoked them. So why did the cigarette appeal to me? And it didn't have a flavor, right? So I smoked it with no flavor, you know? So how do you explain that flavor? It's going to make it's not, you know, especially with, you know. Well, the flavor band is fully, the flavor band is fully bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Even the oh, online yeah. sales, like I said, bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Because well, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, these people are going to get... Let's, let's put it like this. If you can build a fucking vape, what the fuck is stopping you from having these people, you know what I'm saying, possessing a fucking vape? If what? If you can build a vape, what's, what's, that, what's stopping you from possess, having these motherfuckers possessing a fucking vape? If you can make your own liquid, what's to stop someone from being able to possess some fucking liquid? You know what I'm saying? Well, see, that's, that's what... I've been your audio is so fucked. <laughs> can you hear me? Now I can hear you. I'll talk slower. So I think with the, it's going to be like Europe, nicotine is sold. You remember when Baker Man e liquid came out? You didn't. No, I never saw Baker Man. Yeah, yeah, you mix the flavor with it. Is what's going to happen? Is what's going to happen in this industry? We're going to have to sell flavor separately. They're going to give you the nicotine with the flavor. And that, you know what I mean? That's what, um, that's what, you know what I'm saying? That's what dude, that's what Jay Hayes is about to be doing now. You know what I'm saying? Like he was going to be selling zero Nick, you know, uh, zero milligram juice and you got to buy your own Nick for it. Yeah. You got to buy your own. You're going to have to buy your own flavor, own whatever. Hang on. Uh-huh. Miss said, dude who got a customer. Yeah. And look at myself on the goddamn camera. Look at look, see myself. It's looking waving my hand to myself. I'm waving to myself. Chippy and shit. I didn't know the whole time that was a fucking goddamn mirror and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like I thought the whole time that was him standing right there and there was a dude standing behind that not not now, but a little bit moment ago. Well, moment I've been trying to see what's on that on that um shelf though. I'm trying to see what's on that. Look like a whole lot of e juice right there. There's some e juice right here. He ain't got fish ride background though. Fish ride, you know what I'm saying? Got the <laughs> color changing background, you know what I'm saying? With a when you see the beautiful outside and you see that beautiful sky ground, you know, that's beautiful sky in the background and shit. We're about to get up out of here in a minute. I don't want to hold up his day, you know what I'm saying? But I wanted him to get the um I wanted him to come on and talk about, you know what I'm saying, the um the C B D products, you know what I'm saying? Because of course this is his thing, so he can talk about it a lot more better than what I can. Even though the audio was a little bit fucked up. You know the audio was a little bit fucked up. I'm on Hey Sarkas! Hey Sarkas! Oh well, um oh, that'd be man, I'm gonna pass a couple of my homies out here in the um in the group, some of these gummies too. So, um, there be it. Um, uh, these gummies. Now, I say I'm a pass color to my homie, some of the gummies, you know what I'm saying? So, um, there be it to talk about it too on the live stream this Friday, um, that we got coming up. You know, it's on every fucking Friday, you know how we play. This is how they was play. Hey, so we're using that, that foolish caps lock, foolish all in caps. 
get 15% off. Yeah, foolish on and caps. I ain't mitten. I appreciate you for coming through. You know what I'm saying? We about to get up out of here in a minute. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to hold up the dude D out this motherfucker, man, in these streets. No, my boy's in my customer. He's having a good time listening to this. Um, glad that, you know, he knows about the channel now. You know, oh, that's what's up. So he's, he's having a good time listening to us talk. You know, the customers get to see the changes in the industry, too. You know? And um, say what's up. Say what's up. Yeah. Hey, what's going down, Pete? <laughs> yeah. Hey, buddy. So man, we got we got some warriors, dude. Some customers that man, no matter what changes happen in the industry, they always come. To, you know, they always make it happen. You know, for the brick and mortar. You know, so it's real nice. Yeah, that's good, man. You know what I'm saying? I haven't been to a lot of my. I actually, you know, it's kind of crazy. I went past one of the uh, brick and mortars that was like that Thanks was like this. that was down the street down here um, from me, and um, they relocated out here like via Merlin. And um, I was just so having riding past, you know, it was like, you know, supposed to be like business hours and they closed. The, it's like they never really open, man. I was like, damn, man. Like, I don't know. Every time they relocate, they they close the next day. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, can I even stay? <laughs> yeah, no, it's tough. But most definitely, man, we're going to talk. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to hold your day up and everything. But no, we like good, man. Um, everybody's got to make sure that we got to make sure we get, get back on here and do the, the jam on. CBD and the primal CBD, those vape liquids, those cavity doobies. Almost oh, definitely. Almost oh, definitely. Cause I'm be doing my um about to get into my little 420 things on the screen on the on the videos and shit, man. So most well, definitely hey. you got information how to get back with me. So when you come back now, it's not gonna be hard for you to find out how to fucking do it. You already know how to do it and shit. Hopefully my audio works better, man. I gotta figure it out. I don't know what the what the fuck that is. And actually it was kind of cool. I mean, for me, I switched over. We um Started using Zoom and we like the Zoom. Um, shout out to my homeboy Turk. You know what I'm saying? This is his room. Um, he uh, the Zoom platform was a lot better. Tommy uh, Tommy Vapors, you know, he had turned me on to the Zoom platform, and um, you know, I was seeing all the things that he was doing on his, and I'm just like, whoa, man! Like that's just kind of cool. And then like being in the room, it's a lot more better than Google. But of course, you know what I'm saying? Like this is a paid platform, you know, so. Um, mm -hmm course you get better it's just like better quality you know so um yeah man like this this zoom shit i, I love the fuck out of it man it's just, well i'm gonna make sure um, i get the audio problem yeah, i don't know we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna make sure you straight though we're gonna make sure you straight because you know what i'm saying and then we got the um then of course we got the plume lounge you know what i'm saying we be chilling over in the plume lounge a lot so you know what i'm saying and that that's all on this app right here yeah, see the other room that's number to our, the room number to our plume lounge we're nine out of ten i'll be at all the fucking time that's the room right there where he just put the other room number over there. <laughs> yeah, I got that saved, yeah. the 2494. Yeah, so that's the one, you know what I'm saying? Like, what a trip, man. <laughs> LJ, what's going on, Sean Wilkinson? Sean. Sean in the building, man. Yeah, so everybody got to keep, got to bear with us while we do our, our Big Ripper CBD line. Um, I was told that we got some CBD cartridges coming, 200 of them. I'm hoping they're going to be here by like Wednesday or Thursday this coming week. And I'll make sure I send some your way, Foolish. We got the Turp Infused 500 milligram distillate. Um, those are going to be real nice. And they'll be on the website also. Got a lot of stuff coming. Sign up for the newsletter. I got you your account invite. The newsletter is good, you know. Sent out the Foolish newsletter. Yeah, I today. newsletter I had, to dance, had my... Uh, Said you was going live today. I was like, oh shit, you got the fucking the newsletter with the live up in it and shit. That's right. All right. But we want people to know, you know, we're alive. This ain't some like, you know, we're trying to give you guys, give people deals on the CBD that they can't find um, anywhere else, you know, and we work closely with those brands that we have on there. Um, and we're going to be just releasing a lot more stuff, intimate products, the bath products, stuff like that. So it's going to be popping. That's a bet. We're gonna make things. We're we gonna most definitely come back when this month, man. They got the fucking jam monster CBD thing. Yeah, I've already. That's that's gonna be coming real quick. God damn it! I got people texting me about my speaker, bro. <laughs> yeah. You gonna have to fix that shit. And they gotta update the driver. I don't know what the hell it is, man. But look, we about to get up out of here, man. 
So I'm gonna see everybody uh pretty soon. Got the little reviews and everything coming. Then we got the more CBD products. I'm gonna talk about that shit. Can I wait for that jam on side this bitch? This is it's already on the way, bro. This is something new, most definitely to be talked about out of this bitch. I mean, like, I never had this type shit. <laughs> oh man, I can't wait for this. All right, man. I think we it's back. working, man. Look at you, bro. Hey, I don't know. It, as soon as he came in, he was like, man, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I got a jam monster joint. You know, I said, what? Hold up, like yeah. jam monster CBD. Hey, hold yeah. up, girls. Don't say no more. I'm about to go ahead and start this stream real quick so we get this thing started. I ain't never heard of this. And I was yeah. like, getting your yeah. dicks from the back. Whoever had we work, that. We work, we work closely with some brands, you know what I mean? And we're going to be uh, releasing more products. Um, you might see a Jam Monster pod, you know, soon. CBD pod system soon, you know, with those flavors, you know, from those companies. So we're working on a couple things. You know, we're following the trend, you know, Man. but at the same time, you know, trying to get ahead of that. Everybody needs to try to get ahead of the trend. Everybody needs to work together, man, to, to, yeah, to, to, to help follow. each other, you know. <clears throat> I mean, when they first came out with Jam Monster, man, like the dude Crazy. most definitely was cool people was like a motherfucker. But, you know, like a lot of times I always kind of sit back and wonder where they're going to go next, you know. Um, and I'm glad to see that they actually because, you know, like a regular, you know, not a, not too many people are have the mindset as to where they're going to go next and try to get the research and try to figure out what's the next move or what's the next best thing to invest in, you know, hey, and you know. I'm, you know what's crazy, Foolish? It just seems like China knows more about our regulations than we do. <laughs> they probably got their hand in that shit because you don't know That's what's going on. Trade secrets, man. Trade That's secrets. The problem. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you know, look, in Europe, bro, go to Europe, in the neighborhoods, they have a cigarette machine. You swipe your ID and then you swipe your credit card. And they're on the side of the road. What? In the States, like, Maybe we used to have that back in the day. No, they have it on the street now. You yeah, put your ID in first and then your credit card. You can't get the cigarettes without swiping your ID. You know, I'm just saying, like, um, back to the regulation thing. Like, I wish, you know, the government would supply us this the keypad for these types of businesses, right? So you have to swipe it to come in here, you know? If the, if the, if the government's required that and supplied that keypad, yeah. you would have to have it open. You would have to have it installed before opening, you know, and then without the ID, you can't get in there. That would solve that's, a, that's a good fucking idea. That's, that's a you cool know? little fucking thing. I, I mean, mean, they do it. They do it out of that. Yeah, they do it with the cigarette machines in Europe. You just you can't be side right. of the road, bro. Uh, swipe me in real quick, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, exactly, dude. You got to be a certain age, you know? <laughs> All right, man. All right, that's so, a bad, man. Thanks for getting at me, Foolish. I'm glad. Um, thanks, Mitch, for the, the main room um, number right there. This is interesting. Yeah, so you'd most definitely be able to see us over there, man. You know what I'm saying? Over in the other room and everything. But you got my information and everything. We're we going to talk, man. We're going to talk. But yeah, we got we about to get out of here. You know what I'm saying? You stay right there. I'm going to see y'all, you know what I'm saying, a little bit later. Uh, let me see real quick. Um, Word. Yeah, BigRipperCards.com. We got that foolish 15% off on the checkout. 15% off. And that kicked in before the stream was out, man. Tell Donnie how about that, bitch. I'm out this motherfucker. See y'all later. <laughs>